In case you didn't know, that's a prologue. The Warriors of Hope. Around a year and a half ago, a certain incident completely changed the world. Okay. Okay. Apparently, the origin of the incident was a student movement at a certain school. But the school covered it up. So it was too late when the world finally realized it grew out of control. Becoming a monster that swallowed the entire world. It couldn't have just been some riot or student protest. It had to be something far deeper. It was dead rising. How's everyone doing? I'm doing well. Having a lot of fun. I hope you are as well. Been playing D and D a few days ago. Cool. That much should be. Been obvious. enjoying it. It did come from Hope's Peak Academy, after all. Eventually, the incident grew so much in strength and scale that it threw the world into despair. Theft, arson, brutality, murder. The violent crime rate went off the charts. Violence spawned revenge, which fueled more violence, driving the crime rate even higher. Before long, a global war broke out. A war not for land or ideals, but only for the sake of war. A war that tainted the world with despair. But even with all this evil and chaos, I had complete faith in my world. This is the picture that was shown in Danganronpa 1. Um, when uh, Monokuma showed all the students, um, like, th this is what's happening out in the world. This was the picture that was shown to Makoto. And uh, Komaru, who we're playing as in this game, is the young girl there uh, all the way to the left. Junko <laughs> created such a great world. You yeah, know. Playing World of Warships a lot lately? Nice! And streaming on Discord. Streaming on Discord? Really? I didn't even know you could do that. And even when it felt like I was Ugh. falling, I kept believing. Barry on Stormire. It's still okay. Ooh. It's then. Whoops. I found out that seven of my classmates had died suspiciously. I fell further still. What? But even then, I kept telling myself. It's all going to be fine. Don't be afraid. If you have a voice channel, you can stream on there. Oh, cool. But the realization that it was too late came to me like the ground rushing up to break my fall. A group of men I had never seen before broke into my house and separated me from my family. The world I had been living in up to that moment collapsed. Everything changed. And since that horrible and unjust imprisonment, a year and a half passed. I was supposed to be a normal high school girl. But instead, I became a complacent prisoner. Like, but why would they have done that? I don't understand. <laughs> she appears to be nice. I don't know if she ever appeared to be nice. Even, even when, is it Mukuro? Wait. Futaba? Isuki Futaba? Whatever her twin sister, even when she was pretending to be Junko, she didn't seem nice. And what was waiting for me at the end of that despair was a despair even deeper, even worse. Even worse. There's no use in keeping hope. I agree with that statement. That's what I was forced to realize once again. Hey, Casper, how's it going, man? Doing well, doing well. We just had our third kid. About nine weeks ago. So, uh, took a little break from uh, streaming, but we're back, and it's good to see you, man. I knew this was gonna happen. How's things going for you? In my room forever. Just when you thought it was safe to go outside again. I gotta run. Thank you. That's right. Yaki, a guy said that someone is supposed to be here, right? Here, supposed to be here. I might play this game with the controller. I, I don't know. It's it's the mouse is cuckoo in this game. Like it's really hard to control the mouse. That suit. It's the same as that. Bi 
Yakuya guys. Uh. Are you alright? She would have been dead by now, but they gave her food three times a day. So she probably would have stayed alive, actually. Assuming they captured all of the main cast families to hold it as, as leverage if killings weren't happening. It never came out. Came to that, but they still were held. Maybe. Yeah. It is weird, though, that she said, uh, what, like, they killed, like, eight of her friends or something? Who, who are you? You shouldn't be here. Hurry up and run. Uh, um, you're from Future Foundation, right? How, how did you know? I, I was told by a guy named Byakuya Tagami to meet you here. Could you be? Are you a captive? I don't know. I could be a captive in yellow text. I don't know. Go to the park. Head through this door and go straight down the road. There should be a future foundation helicopter there. Hurry, go. Also, this guy's name is Future Foundation A. Nice. Friends dying was just a consequence of the tragedy, I think. Okay. Also, they don't really explain that ever. But what about you? They make such cute noises. Hurry. You got to get out of here. I I'm sorry. Kamaru, you are the one. Summer vacation, nice! So Playing some AC Odyssey. <laughs> nice. I had a really good time in that game. I think I think I got to 200 hours. It was just fun going around and like trying to take over all the uh, camps and stuff. It's in ruins. Break! Uh hello. Oh! So we're so okay. It's different now. Cool car. Look at that car. In the future. Uh, hello? Did this game just crash, kind of? What is it? Oh. Nothing happened. Oh, Makoto's fine. Don't worry about it. Yeah, let's run. Cute white widow tiger bear. <laughs> Only 30 ish hours into it, and it just got to level 21. Nice. Are you people from There's a lot of game to be had there. She doesn't have cool sunglasses like this guy. Did he now? Oh wow! Level four eighty in ESO. Kamaru, it's Kamaru Naegi. Oh. Looks like that information about a captive in this town was correct. So, where is Byakuya Togami? Is he safe? I don't know. He he told me to run, so I I haven't seen him since. I see. I can't reach him, so I thought he might be in danger. But then again, this is Byakuya Tagami we're talking about. I'm sure he can handle himself. But, but, but there was someone from Future Foundation getting attacked in the restaurant back there! Please, you have to go save him! Are they robots? Understood. I'll go back for him. Oh, ne never mind. This one has heart. I hope he can make it in time. Um, what exactly is going on here? I still have no idea what's happening. I don't know who you are, or where I am, or anything. I see. Well, we don't have much time, so I'll give you the short version. This one sounds like Byakuya. First off, we're from an organization called Future Foundation. We're trying to help the world recover from the incident. You know what I'm referring to? Incident? Nope. It's behind your imprisonment. The biggest, most awful, most tragic event in human history. It was more than just an incident. 
It shook the foundations of society to the core. <laughs> oh. Various incidents broke out all over the world. The name of this game is Danganronpa, another episode, Ultra Despair Girls. And um, Danganronpa is uh, <laughs> kind of a visual novel type game. Um, this one's a little different. There's a little, they, they added a little bit of action to it. Um, but I, I believe this game bridges things between Danganronpa 2 and 3. And we beat Danganronpa 2 earlier this year. And uh, this is kind of just to tie the two together. There's also an anime that th that this kind of ties into it uh, into as well. So yeah, I'm uh, like we we played both of these. I have a terrible memory, but I can remember some of the stuff. But a lot of what's going on here is is like new. Like I didn't know that Makoto's sister was alive. Yeah, you never heard of it? Uh, they're pretty popular for um, visual novels. Um, and I believe they're only on PC and PS4. They just recently got released on iOS. And then the war. The biggest, most awful, most tragic event in human history includes that too. Because of all of this, the world just crumbled. But in all that chaos, Future Foundation is trying the best we can to bring hope back to this world. Oh, and as for this town... Are you alright? Are you following? <laughs> uh, sure, I'm, I'm following. Yep. Uh, yeah. It's just a lot to take in, that's all. It's... hard to hear. It's hard to hear? Is it because of all the booms? It's, it, it, it's the booms, it's loud. I'm sorry, but you need to know. Actually, there are no booms. Um, this town is an island off the coast and controlled by a powerful IT corporation. It's commonly called Toa City. Toa City used to just be a nickname, but now it's what everyone calls it. It's a nickname. Ever since the government stopped functioning due to the tragedy, Toa Group and their cutting edge technology are running the show here. Toa Group is a corporation that played a huge role in rebuilding the world. Ever since the tragedy, air pollution has made a lot of the planet uninhabitable. But Toa Group developed an air purifier that can clean massive quantities of air at a time. They invented it only three months after the safety order to stay indoors was given. Even after all this time, people all over the world are still clamoring for it. But the clean air isn't the only thing that draws people to this town. Because of Toa Group's influence, this city has suffered far less damage than others. And because it's relatively unaffected by the incident, it's of special interest to us. But this kind of riot going on in Toa City, this is something we never anticipated. I like this guy's move. It's nice. It's nice. He can do that all day. Uh, okay. So it's a riot? Why is something like this happening? Honestly, even we have no clue whatsoever about what's happening here. Where those Monokumas came from, why they're attacking the city, and that broadcast by those creepy kids. None of it makes any sense at all. Oh, there's also a little bit of Children of the Corn in this game too, yeah. That's new. The only thing we know for sure is that something horrible is happening here. We need to get more intel, but our priority is to escape. We need to leave, at least for now. Yeah, you're right. We need to hurry and escape. We'd probably get killed in a place like this. Probably. And, um, I mean, I want to see my family again. It's been so long, I... Oh, about your family. They're all dead. Hold it. What was that? Do you hear that? The booms. Is that it's worse than the booms. <laughs> it's worse than the booms. Oh no. <laughs> you know, I've had a nightmare like this. Get back. <laughs> 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 
That bear is making out with that man. Go, go, go! Let's fly! Let's go! <laughs> what the fun? <laughs> Who let that bear drive the helicopter? <laughs> it's so irresponsible. <laughs> what have you gotten yourself into? What have we all gotten ourselves into? Oh, this is... This is the execution music. I think we needed that. Is that death number one? Somehow we survive. Holy potatoes. <laughs> this seems kind of like a bad situation. I, I, don't, I don't know. We've survived worse. I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> oh, question marks. More question marks. Hey. Uh, Makoto? Can you hear me? Are you okay? He sounds older. Mm -mm. Remember, that's their brother and sister, guys. <laughs> you look completely exhausted. No. Who are you? Me. Oh. Nagato? Name's not really important. After all, I'm just a lowly servant. No. No. I had heard this town would be safe, so I came here to seek refuge. Then the riots. Notice as well, he has his arms folded. You can't see his left arm or his right arm or hands. Hands. Um, if you remember from Danganronpa 2, you'll remember the thing. And on top of that, I get captured by them. I've seriously got no luck at all. But because I pleaded for my life, they allowed me to live as their servant. He has a, like a, a glove mitten type thing on his left hand. On the hand, exactly. So, you know what, we're, what I'm talking about. You get it. Uh, um. ah, I'm being rude. Enough about me. Let's talk about you. Enough about me. Let's talk about you. Either you truly are completely exhausted or you're simply afraid to wake up and face reality. You were asleep a full two days. A, a full two days? A full two days. More than enough time for the world to change completely. More than it already was? Oh, Nagato. Same old Nagato. Yes, even our world can change just that quickly. Like a watercolor painting caught in the rain. Ah. But you're more concerned about yourself than the world right now, correct? You're wondering what's to become of you now that you're trapped here in this place. He, he gives me a very uncomfortable feeling, too. Um, also, what's... Well, he, he, his name is Servant now, but he's also got like a... A chain collar thing on him. It's just weird. It's creepy. What's going to happen to me? I don't know. Hey, a gift! Is that for me? I just noticed. Also, it's in green! Channel colors. Nice. Uh, apologies. Your reaction was so... normal. 
It surprised me a little. <laughs> you honestly don't have a single unique characteristic. Much like my brother. Uh, um... Well, no need to be depressed about it. This world is filled with unremarkable people. And the only one capable of empathizing with common, boring people is a common, boring person like yourself. So that's why you pass. What, what are you talking about? Well, that is just my personal Oh, opinion. oops. It doesn't matter to them at all. Shadow, this is between one and two? Okay, then I was wrong. I thought it was bridging the gap between two and three. I'm sorry, everybody. That's, that is wrong information. Shadow magic is basically magic-based math. Really. Which means I'll need I love to math. A proper test. A test? Ah, but before that, I'll return this to you. Why? Why would he give it back to me? New truth bullet. The, the hacking gun. Pretty sure it said Pokemon. I was, didn't know Pokemon was in this game. I borrowed it from you without permission. Sorry, but I absolutely had to analyze its capabilities. It sure is an amazing little machine. A device that forcibly hacks machines by shooting program codes with electromagnetism. However, it was a bit too powerful. I made a few modifications for game balance purposes. For game balance purposes? <laughs> Excuse me? <laughs> Most of the time, I'm not going to know what's happening from the way things seem. Game balance? Oh, no need to worry. You'll have the opportunity to upgrade it later. Uh, um, I have no idea what you're talking about. I understand how you feel, but it's about time you started the test. If you can safely make it all the way to where everyone is waiting, you pass. Everyone? Easy peas. He's aware. He is very aware. He breaks down that wall with the greatest of ease. You'll meet them when you get there. However, even after you meet everyone, be sure to keep that gun of yours a secret. If you don't want to die, that is. I'll be going on ahead. All the locks. What the heck? What is going on now? <gasps> oh! I thought it was unlimited bullets, and I just saw that go from thirty-five to thirty-four. It's a present. Pokemon. Time for another tutorial. Looks like you have obtained Move. Move is a truth bullet that can activate some machines with superpowered hacking magic. Try it on that power panel with the red light. Oh, and I know you probably remember, but you can press the F key to change ammo. Uh. It's Move! I'm so scared. Time for another tutorial. Now that you've put in some time with the hacking gun, let me tell you something. The red left eye is a weak point for all Monokumas. Oh! Shoot that weak point with break. And most Monokumas go down in one shot. Plus, after you hit a weak spot, break ammo will give you one, one power shot. It's one hell of a shot. One that's way stronger than the regular break. Now that's killing two birds with one stone. If you think you're so hot, why not why not try aiming for the weak point? Fine, I will. There it is again. Yo, I got you in the eye. Oh. Ooh, a coin. It's weaker. Is this the game balance that guy was talking about? Man, it's, it's, it's like Metroid where they gave me all the toys. I didn't use all the toys. And now they took away all the toys. 
it's oh oh i have to actually pick it up oh nice it sounds like uh sonic the hedgehog oh man ugh ugh is there a secret is this the right way does it look like the right way hold on there's gotta be a way to switch that um No, no. Options, there we go. Change the camera controls if you choose auto, the camera automatically follows you. I'm use manual. Oh, this, this might be better. Okay, this, this might be better. How did someone come in here? Ah, uh, they probably let them borrow the, uh, sound. Ah! In- <laughs> Right in your eye. Whoa! Did I just get locked in? Looks like it. Maybe I should try to move something again. Uh, yeah, let's try moving something again. Go up to the room past the stairs. Uh. Wait, let's switch. Also, just for reasons, anytime you meet someone, check your people list. It will give you a little information on them. Okay. Oh, wonderful. Bum, 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 bum. Here are those kids. The kids who were on TV. Oh, man. I'm famous. <laughs> I'd autograph your back anytime. <laughs> I can only write using a chisel, but if you don't mind that, I can sign your back, too. We accept presents as well. I'm always in the mood for sweets. However, salty flavors are no good. Those disgusting tastes are never worth putting in your mouth. Mm, I want to drive a train someday. But have I ever played Hitman I Absolution? I have not. I actually have never played a Hitman game. I own several of them. But that'd be a fun game to play too. Did she just meow and also a big sis? Um, uh, I, uh, <laughs> okay. Oh, that's right. Big sis doesn't know us yet. Well, I guess we should start with introductions. All right, let's start with me, the leader. I'm the leader of the Warriors of Hope. Hero class, Masaru Diamond. I always give 100%. My favorite class was Jim, so they called me Lil Ultimate PE. Wait a second. He looks like a combination of Leon and Diamondo. Or Mondo. It's a weird thing in Japan, an anime little ones you will usually call older girls. Big sis. Oh, okay. You're no warriors? I don't know. We'll see. Aha! A hero, the leader, and the little ultimate PE. I even impressed myself. <laughs> You're far too boastful to be a leader. A true leader is calm and dignified. But I am the leader. We all agreed on it. All he did was win rock, paper, scissors. Doesn't matter! I'm still the leader! I won, so I'm the leader! The leader! Fine, fine. You're the leader. Now, allow me to introduce myself. I am the sage, Nagisa Shingetsu. 
I am the vice leader of sorts. She kind of reminds me of, I, is it Futaba Ibuki or something from the first game? The one that got blowed up and was pretending to be Junko? Kind of looks like her mixed with the ninja girl from the second game. 